Hello and welcome to the session. In today's session, we are going to, to explore how you can resolve an issue that you may uh, experience uh, when you access your HANA Studio and you get an error message that says a secure storage is locked. Now, this may, can happen because of different reasons. Uh, if your uh, storage is being stored under a different username than the current you are using or uh, some other reasons, the security uh, get locked meaning uh, the current logged in user cannot access the security, the storage or the workspace of the HANA Studio that was being used in the past. And you will have to uh, do a few steps in order to uh, allow you to unlock uh, that. So you can try to unlock, and if you have if you set up a, a master password, uh, you'll be able to uh, unlock the storage. Uh, but in most cases, sometimes if you forgot to do that or you didn't do that, uh, there are other ways to uh, resolve that. And I will go to show the simplest way to uh, help you um, uh, work around this issue. So uh, if, uh, first, what we'll have to do is as follows. So what, uh, what we'll have to do is uh, uh, you can go to the uh, HANA Studio uh, window menu and go to the preferences. Under preferences, go to the general and the security sub menu and open the secure storage. Uh, here we can go to the content and select the uh, the current secure storage that you have uh, defined when you last time when you logged in and created the uh, the workspace and you can click on delete so this uh, ask if you're sure if you want to delete the uh, the workspace and of course uh, if you have any type of settings in the workspace they will uh, be lost but in uh, in some cases this is not really critical so you can do that so let's click yes and it will restart Okay, and now uh, you have a new uh, secure uh, storage, uh, and it's you can being going to be asked you're going to be asked to create a new master password, which you can do in this case. You can create a new master password with asking questions. You don't have to do that, but now you can access and you have now a new uh, storage that you can use, uh, and um, you should be able to access your system as usual with the new workspace and storage defined. Thank you. I hope you find this session helpful.